Let's take a look at that push button. You can find it in the lower left corner of the launch pad. Go ahead and push it a couple of times. When you push the button down and then let it go, you can feel it being lowered and then it automatically pops back up into its original position. We may not think a lot about it, but buttons like this are relatively common in our lives. So what is the P1.1 push button switch? Your microcontroller's digital inputs and outputs are organized into groups of eight called ports. Specifically, the name P1.1 comes from the fact that the button is connected to pin one of port one of the microcontroller. Now each of these port pins can be configured as inputs or outputs, but we'll get to that a little bit later. Next, the P1.1 push button is a normally open switch. That means when the switch is not pushed, there is not an electrical connection through it. The switch is considered an open circuit. However, when the button is pushed, there is an electrical connection through it. When the button is pushed, we can consider that the switch is a short circuit. The attached PDF will talk you through three points. First, it will show you how to get the push button to work in more detail. Second, the handout will show you how the push button is connected electrically to the microcontroller on the launch pad. And finally, the PDF will step you through the code necessary for your microcontroller to read the state of the switch. In the next video, we will introduce a new C command, the if statement, and see how it can be used to make decisions in your program based upon the state of the switch.